Supreme Master Ching Hai's lectures are not a complete meditation instruction. Please do not try alone. For free of charge guidance, please visit godsdirectcontact.org or contact any of the centers near you. Today's episode will be presented in English, Spanish and Chinese with subtitles in Arabic, Olaxis, also known as Vietnamese, Bulgarian, Chinese, Czech, English, French, German, Hindi, Hungarian, Indonesian, Japanese, Korean, Malay, Mongolian, Persian, Polish, Portuguese, Romanian, Russian, Spanish and Thai. Radostné pozdravy jsou cítní diváci. Jmenuji se Vladimíra, jsem z Olomouce, z kulturně a historicky rozmanité České republiky. Česká republika, nacházející se ve střední Evropě, je bohatá v rozmanitosti a kultuře. Praha, hlavní město, je veřejně považována za jedno z nejkrásnějších a nejčastěji navštěvovaných měst v Evropě. Tato skvělá země je velká srdcem a zavedla mnoho zákonů k ochraně a záchraně přírodních krás, její fauny a flóry. Krajině dominují hornaté oblasti, horské masivy lemují zemi ze všech stran. Vodní toky, naplněné vodou stajícího sněhu a čerstvých dešťových vod, stékajících z okolního terénu, jsou živé a vibrující. S touto neskutečnou scenérií je Česká republika domovem úžasné škály krásné fauny a flóry, kterým se skvěle daří v tomto nebi na zemi. Je nám ctí představit vám fascinující Českou republiku. Přejeme vám, aby bylo vaše srdce naplněno milující vlídností. Již více než tři desetiletí přináší nejvyšší mistrně Ching Hai světlo na náš svět svým božským učením. Plně osvícená mistrně předává meditační metodu Kvan Yin těm, kteří touží okamžitě objevit boží přirozenost uvnitř sebe a v jediném životě dosáhnout věčného vysvobození z cyklu převtělování. Metoda Kvan Yin byla dosud praktikována všemi osvícenými mistry, například Budhou, Ježíšem Kristem, prorokem Mohamedem, Mír s ním a Guru Nanakem. Mistrině zdůrazňuje, že pokud máme vždy na paměti Boha, poskytujeme nezištnou službu druhým a následujeme zákony ve smíru, dosáhneme svého nejvyššího potenciálu jako lidé a skutečně pochopíme náš účel na zemi. Nejvyšší mistrině Ching Hai je mimořádným živým příkladem soucitu, pravidelně posílající materiální a finanční pomoc, jakož i lásku, uprchlíkům, bezdomovcům, obětem přírodních katastrof a dalším potřebným. V roce 2006 obdržela Gusyho cenu za mír, považovanou na východě za Nobelovu cenu za mír a během let byla poctěna řadou dalších ocenění a vyznamenána za její výjimečnou lidskost a humanitární činy.
jako skutečný zastánce našich krásných zvířecích přátel prosazuje pokojnou a láskyplnou rostlinou stravu a s probuzením lidstva k posvátnosti veškerého života předvídá klidný a nádherný zcela veganský svět, kde zvířata i lidé žijí v blažené harmonii. Její iniciativy šíření veganských trendů jsou různorodé a zahrnují distribuci letáků alternativního života, mezinárodní řetězec veganských restaurací Loving Hut, Supreme Master Television a také pravidelné hovory k vlidným vládám, mediálním vůdcům a účasti na televizních konferencích o klimatických změnách, ať jsme si jich vědomi či ne. Její úsilí mělo obrovský vliv na globální povědomí ohledně životního stylu, přátelského ke zvířatům a také na to, jak tento laskavý způsob bytí může přinést trvalý mír mezi národy, přičemž zachrání naši planetu před klimatickými změnami. Během let cestovala nejvyšší mistrině Činghaj po celém světě, od Ameriky po Afriku, z Evropy po Oceánii a vedla stovky proslovů a diskuzí s veřejností a svými žáky o různých duchovních tématech. Dnes máme to požehnání vám představit jednu z těchto osvícených přednášek pod názvem Mír a lásky plné potraviny, čtvrtá část ze šesti v pořadu mezi mistriní a žáky v angličtině, španělštině a čínštině z 23. března 2012 ve Francii. Normally a master should not talk about the suffering or complaining. But I thought why not, you know? I think you should also know me, you know, so that we connect it. Yes? Because sometimes a parent do things but the children doesn't know, don't know. And then they kind of uh, separated and feeling not uh, oneness, you know? Not, uh, how do you say, the, the empathy are not within each other, you know? And if the parents and the children more share, you know, sharing, and the children understand the parents, then maybe the love grows stronger, you know, between them. And once the love is stronger, everything else is easier. You understand? Yes, not like love is necessary in the family, but in order to have love, uh, mutual love between parents and children, the children should know also what bother the parents and how parents have to work. You know, otherwise how do they know? See what I mean? Yes. Okay, so it wasn't like, um, oh, I think it was necessary, so you know a little bit, huh? Uh, maybe you cannot imagine, but it's okay to know a little bit. It's no secret, yeah? Yes. Because uh, even then, uh, it's just the same like all the time. Any teacher, you know, brings something uh, good to this world, has to endure a lot of trouble, suffering. It's normal, yes? I just want you to know that in this time, it's still real. That's all, okay? And then so that you maybe appreciate the chance that you have hmm? and know that how much I love you. Because <laughs> or you can think that your master is crazy because <laughs> otherwise she won't do what she's doing or what she did. Huh? Either she loves you or she's crazy. Pick your choice. <laughs> Yeah, it's, uh, why not? You, you should also know what I do a little bit. No? I mean, I cannot tell everything, of course, because we don't have time and we don't just dwell on all these negativities. Just that a little bit, now and then, when the opportunity presents itself, and it's okay, naturally, okay? No problem. Uh, you don't have to thank me. Maybe you earn it, okay? <laughs> all right, guys, <laughs> I love you so much. Please tell me more stuff, poem, whatever. <laughs> You write very nicely. We on Hong Kong also love you so much and thanks for your kindness and um, noble grace uh, giving us the uh, Tinshan Acha. 
uh, a lot of blessing power there and it is very convenient to go there and we are very encouraged to, to go daily for group meditation. Yeah, and the mountain? Yeah, the mountain. Mm. It's very beautiful and yes. very peaceful. Fresh. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. A lot master. of uh, oxygen and a lot of blessing now. Yeah. Mm. Thank you, Master. Have even some heaven gates there. Yeah. Heaven, yeah. We treasure heaven. the chance to go there. Yeah. Yeah. You should. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, Master. Yes. As we, uh, as the, the planet's getting better, the consciousness higher, we can have more and more heaven gates in different centers. Meoli have now, you know, Tainan has. Um, yeah, of course, here, yes, it's a lot. And um, even Japan, the, the house, the little wood house in Japan that I bought, have, yes. Mm. And some brothers, sister like to uh, go to uh, Maori for short stay and yes. or here, but if they don't have any holidays and work hard yes. in Hong Kong, they just go to uh, Tinshan Ashram for meditation. Yeah. So that we have many chances and the freedom to yeah. go elsewhere. Thank you, Master. Yeah, okay. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> just enjoy your fortune. Hmm? Yeah, I used to live there. I love that very much, especially when it rains, you know. Uh, my level has uh, a little river around it, and then it's like a big river coming. You know, all the steps are like a um, waterfall, and very beautiful. I love it so much. And a lot of bananas and a lot of uh, tangerines. Yeah. It's a good time you, you cook you cookies and yeah. do the painting on the fence. So yeah. we, we have a very good memory yeah. <laughs> when we are in the uh, Tinshan Asha. Yeah, yes. in that little hut that I have. Huh? Yeah. Mm. yeah, so is that. Cannot always stay in one place, but otherwise, I really love Hong Kong also, that beautiful place. In the morning, do they still come and screaming on the hill? <laughs> Five o'clock in the morning? No, not because uh, the no neighbor um, complain. It's ah. noisy, so now we are quiet. There. Not you, not you. The, the neighbor? Not, Sometimes they sing, you know. The, no, the guy who go onto the hill behind it's our better, ashram and yeah, yeah. shout very loud and long uh, in the morning. holiday, they still shout because they are happy, maybe. <laughs> no, no, they like just believe in the health or whatever. Oh, they have to scream very yeah, loud. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh! Five o'clock to six o'clock in the morning, every day. How can you be healthy screaming like that? <laughs> we are not there because it's too early in that time. <laughs> ah, that's why. When I live there, they, they operate like that every day in the morning when I start to meditate. Yeah, even pluck your cotton in your ear, you still can hear them like a big, 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 you know, the horn from the train. Off on the ship. <laughs> so noisy. <laughs> oh my God. So loud, so loud. I mean, really loud. They're doing that for fun. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what else? If not, uh, we meditated almost two o'clock. Can you believe it? Really talking about time running fast. <laughs> you, you said you're suffering. I have two dreams. Yes. And the one is uh, that you asked me to give you a massage, and then I see black and blue all over your body. Mm -hmm. And then you have wounds on the flesh. It's as big as this, like chi money. The what? What is the, it? The, the wounds on the flesh. The, the, the wound? The cut. The cut. On the the cut, uh, the yeah. wound? Yeah, the wounds. Yeah. The wound, okay. Yeah. Injury. Yeah, yeah it's okay. like big, like oh. this. Okay. And uh, the next and the flesh time, on yeah, the body. The uh -huh. next time, it, and uh, you asked me to press the Ren Zhong that is here. Mm -hmm. That is only when your life is in danger. In the mm -hmm. Chinese, you press here. Press here. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. like that. Okay. So I know how much you suffer. Not everybody see that. <laughs> I'm sorry, you have to see that. I don't know why you see that. It's not nice. You must maybe at that time you think of me too deeply. That's why you can you can connect. Yeah, I I, I it's not a nice yeah, uh, thing that, to know. At that time, I pray to I pray to heaven that uh, that with all my love for you, um, life after life, that uh, your your be your staying retreat, uh, not going out to to see us, especially the disciples. I think that will be bad better for the world and better for your physical body. Uh, thank you. It's okay. If I can, I do anything, you know. 
not just retreat, but see people, see you, all the same. You know, I mean, we do this and then we stop and then we do it again. You know, it depends. Okay? Yes. It's also good that I do retreat and don't see you. Because I can do more. You see, I can be stronger and recharge. And then if I see you, then it's better for you also. Okay? Mm. Even if I don't see you, also good for you. Mm. But if I see you, also good for you, no? You like, no? <laughs> yes, we do both, eh? Whatever we can. All right. But uh, next time, don't think of me too much. Because all these things are not nice to know. You know, not nice to see it so graphically. Okay? Just uh, <laughs> happened in my dream. Okay, I cannot I control yes. it. Uh, okay, fine. Because you you concerned with me too much. That's why you you connect and you see it. Yeah. Mm. Just don't care. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone else? But thank you anyway for your love. Yeah, behind there. I can't see you. Stand up. Take a look at me. Uh, yes. I mean, I'm sorry for this. Uh, I don't know, the, the staircase is so high, you can't see me, huh? Yeah. Hello, Master. Hello. I'd like to say you look very elegant tonight. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> I thought I looked like springtime. <laughs> Come on, tell me. I have some good news from Ireland. From where? Ireland. Ireland, okay, yes. welcome. Um, originally, we just had one vegan society in Ireland, but now we have five. Oh. So and, fast? Yeah, and they've, they're spread around the different parts of the country. Uh-huh. And, um, North or South or both? Um, uh, mostly the South of Ireland, Cork and Galway. And, oh, thank to you, no? <laughs> thank to you guys in Ireland. And also in the, the biggest university in um, Dublin, there's a vegan society now there. Oh. And um, they, they went, the students went to the chef in the restaurant and and demand that they have vegan, special vegan food. In the campus. Yeah, ah, exactly. In the canteen, wonderful, yeah. wonderful. Hey, um, how come they're so strong? Everybody demanding things. Yeah, and? And um, also, uh, you know, the Irish Independent and the Sunday Independent, they're the biggest um, newspapers in Ireland. And um, now they are constantly um, doing vegan recipes in the, in the papers. Oh, yeah. imagine. Yeah. Wow, bless them. Yeah, and, you know, and doing vegan articles and, you know, promoting about vegan, how, how healthy it is and how it's um, more eco-friendly. And healthy and yeah. all, yeah. yeah, wow. So it's really great. And um, also, um, we were involved with a very famous um, a model. She was Miss Universe. Yeah, yeah, I saw it on TV. She was cool, eh? Yeah, yes. and she, originally she was vegetarian. And when she worked with us, she became vegan. Mm -hmm. And um, they actually, the vegan people are very proud of her. And she is now, she calls herself... Um, um, Miss three, Vegan? Yeah, Three Star Vegan. Uh, <laughs> three Star? <laughs> yeah, she's ter third degree vegan. Well, why third degree? Well, it's just to say that she's like she really, you know, she's proud to be vegan. Why third degree? Uh, I don't know. I just... mean, okay, okay. It's mean the ultimate in whatever. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, she's a Miss Vegan Universe. <laughs> right. Okay. And also, the Irish government now, have, in a few years' time, they are going to completely ban all alcohol advertising in all sports events, you mm -hmm, know, like, mm -hmm. you know, the way they put, um, yeah, yeah, they, they're the biggest sponsors, you know, the alcohol, now they're, yes. they're banging it, complete wow. ban. Wow, wow. Benefits of alcohol bans. Stroke risk reduced by 50% by quitting smoking and restricting alcohol consumption, along with more exercise and higher fruit and vegetable intake. Researchers in Spain find that alcohol-free beer reduces cholesterol levels along with other potential heart benefits without any of the risks associated with alcohol consumption. Financial savings. A Canadian study estimates alcohol intervention programs could save 880 lives and 1 billion US dollars every year. Mortality. A 10% decline in vodka sales resulted in a significant decrease in alcohol-related deaths in Russia in one year. Exercising, drinking less alcohol, eating fruits and vegetables, and not smoking extends life expectancy by 14 years. 
Cancer. A World Cancer Research Fund study finds reducing meat and alcohol consumption decreases cancer risk. Other illnesses. The brain's regeneration and performance are increased once alcohol consumption ceases. Alcoholic hepatitis patients can gain complete recovery if the patient gives up alcohol and has a good diet. Bodybuilding.com states that bodybuilders who refrain from alcohol consumption experience benefits in terms of muscle gain, hydration, recovery, metabolism, and mental focus. Social implications. A New Zealand liquor ban resulted in 98% less liquor offenses as well as a reduction in other crimes. Research in New Mexico, USA shows that Sunday bans on alcohol sales resulted in fewer collisions and traffic casualties. Alcohol-related crimes dropped by 15% following an alcohol ban in Aberystwyth, UK. An alcohol ban becomes permanent on the jetty area of Coffs Harbour City, Australia, due to its success in reducing crime. Youth. In the U.S. state of Florida, raising the legal drinking age from 18 to 21 significantly reduced auto accident-related fatalities. A voluntary ban of alcohol sales to youth under 21 in the UK's Marsk village is made permanent as crime and antisocial behavior is reduced. An alcohol ban in US colleges helps overall alcohol abstention and reduces bouts of drunkenness and secondhand effects of drinking. Plus more. For more information, please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash harms dash benefits dash flyer and um, another yeah I talk uh, we have one of your uh, former president you know in Cancun remember her that's right and she's so cool she's so Mary cool. Robinson yeah yeah she's so cool so casual you know and so uh, very uh, humble but very great yes and she came to support us, you know, she didn't have to, she has many where to go, people would, you know, like invited her everywhere in that kind of event, but she came to us, spare some precious time to come support us and talk to people. Same with the president of Costa Rica, eh? And great people, yes. I wish we had more leaders like that in the world, no? Eh? Yes, any more? Yes, and also... Good uh, for your country. And also the government, um, um, the ministers now, um, they are going to ban all fast food um, restaurants close to the um, uh, uh, schools oh. because um, there's a problem with obesity in, yes. in Ireland now. So they're they're trying to bring in that law to ban oh. all fast food. Wonderful. The, God's good you know, news. Bless Ireland. <laughs> Congratulations. Mm? Yes. That is a trend, it's going up, eh? Just the beginning, yes. That's it, Master. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, wonderful news. <laughs> oh, come on, the guys don't say anything. It's a woman vegan world, huh? <laughs> we are good, no? Yeah, we are pretty. Yeah, I just remember the joke because the translation say, your face look like a cow bone. He say, your face look like a cow. <laughs> Translator, bad, bad, bad. What's a chow, huh? <laughs> quick, 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 quick. We don't wait all night. Time is already running too quick. <laughs> Tell. Master, um, I don't know how to say it, but every minute, every second, me and my husband cannot live without you. The one thing I scare um, um, uh, a lot because you always take come of our disciple. I don't know what the path like between you and me. Mm -hmm. I wish I don't do anything wrong. Why? What did you do wrong? I don't know. I just scared. I love you so much. Scared about what? What the path like? Do I do anything wrong with you? <laughs> but you're too far away if you do. <laughs> <laughs> and so many people, not just you. It's all right, love. It's okay. Your love is very good. Even if you do anything wrong, your love will, your love for me will dissolve it all. Don't I, worry. I live with, I cannot live without you, Master. No. Well, it's okay. You don't have to. <laughs> I'm still here. Yeah. That's why I'm still here. Because I know you cannot live without me. I know that. I'm psychic. <laughs> Every single minute, me. 
Eh? Because every any... time you come, you always cry. How can I forget? <laughs> <laughs> I don't do anything wrong on the path line right of now. Of course you do. <laughs> All of them. Everybody does. If you didn't do anything wrong, what would you stay here for? It's okay if you did. We all do, okay? Humans, in the Buddhism, the Sutra, Tathagata, Kinh Địa Tạng, Thi Chang Hoàng Phu Sa, I think, Christic Gabba Sutra, the earth store Buddha, the Buddha stay in hell to help uh, the people. In that sutra, he spoke like uh, he looked in the human world, all the humans, any thought, any movement, create karma. Yeah, all the humans, any thought in their mind, any movement they make, all created karma for themselves. So nobody is exception. All right? Yes. Do not worry about it. Remember the Buddha in his former lives, sometimes he also made mistakes, yeah? But then he learned and he became a Buddha, yes? It's okay if we made mistakes in the past. Hmm? I cannot uh, write a book about your karma, okay? <laughs> Too many, but it doesn't matter. It's the past, okay? Too bad. Hmm? Too bad. I love you already. What can I do? Eh? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Okay? Mm. Even uh, even if you did something wrong in the past, but you you and your husband cannot <laughs> alone cannot harm me. It is uh, many people come out together in the whole planet. Yes? Understand? Uh, it's okay. Don't blame yourself. It's normal if you have karma. <laughs> if you don't have karma, <laughs> Difficult to come here also, yeah? Be happy that you can come here, yes? And we together, okay? Yes. Mm. Thank you much. You're welcome. That's it, right? Okay. <laughs> you look always the same. Why don't you go over a little bit? <laughs> Before you, Matthew. Always cry like a kid. <laughs> yeah, okay. She and her husband are big, a major, you know, <laughs> always crying. <laughs> Her husband also, tough guy, always crying. Before, he's very tough, you know? He never keep, she told me, huh? I remember you told me, her husband never keep any job more than two weeks. <laughs> yeah, somehow he's managed to be fired, or he fired himself. If he's fired, then he went outside in the corner, wait for the boss to come out and give him something. <laughs> for his boss, you know? We come out and regulate him. <laughs> but now he's like a lamp, you know? He cries a lot because he loves me. Uh, I also don't know how, whether you did wrong or not wrong in the past or not, but I don't know how you love me that much. <laughs> you cannot live without me. Okay, you cannot live without me. Yeah. But can, you cannot live with me either, right? <laughs> you have to go home. <laughs> it's okay, love, it's okay. I understand very much. I know you love me, that's why I have to come see you. Hmm? Hmm. So I wish I could see any, all of you every day, I mean, any time. Because I also feel good to see you, hmm? to see you grow and to feel the love from you. It's very comfortable to feel this kind of love. You know, the uh, unattached love, you know, a high level love, different kind of love, yeah? Not the dragging love, you know? <laughs> Not a demand in love, but just love. It's very comfortable also. I wish that like this center open every day and I can just come to see and you can come anytime, you know, take turn to come. Anybody can come and stay. And when your time is done, you go and then other people come. And, you know, it's so free and I can come see you every day. I wish I could do that, but maybe we could, who knows? Yes, we, we do what we can, you know, slowly, slowly, maybe we get there. Oh, the center that you're talking about, how far from Paris uh, airport? How many hours drive? Four hours? Huh? The, the, the village? Yeah. Uh, three hours. Three hours from Paris drive? From Paris hotel? I mean, airport? Uh, yes, yeah. I don't know if we should make more. Yeah, can see if it's okay or not, you know. It's, very cheap, but I don't know if we can make it into a center to meditate or not. If can, then okay. 
Yeah, no problem. Make your own village. Yeah, make your own village. Grow potato and <laughs> carrot and all the fruit in the list. <laughs> yes, so when you come for retreat, you eat only pure food of love. Mm? Yes. Okay, so if they can stay in these two houses, uh, then they can stay and then arrange that they can come every night. Okay? Uh, I don't need this actually. Yeah, tell me, anything more? Yeah, okay, this, uh, it's okay, yeah. Yeah, it's good. Huh? Good, this one you can table you know, in the kitchen or somewhere so people, people can... Uh, don't say ignore the brother or sister <laughs> next to you. Just <laughs> say, just say that, uh, how you say, and try to be self-centered, you know, center within. Try to be alone in the group. Say, ignore the brother and sister next. <laughs> what kind of talk is that? <laughs> Love the brother or sister next to you, but be, be more inward, more inward. Be more yourself inward. That's maybe better like that, okay? Come on, rewrite this. You need some editor. It's best... It's best to keep... It's best not to talk to others or even think of others. And do not look around for boyfriends, girlfriends. <laughs> Please rewrite it. Make it more elegant, okay? I mean, talking and writing are completely different things, huh? There's some good writer around here? Good writer for Supreme Master Televisions before? Yeah, rewrite it. I mean, it's the same meaning, just rewrite it. People feel more comfortable. <laughs> when we talk, it's different than when we write, okay? Talking different. Okay. Yeah, it is, uh, it is true like that, but it's put it too harshly, even worse than when I spoke it. <laughs> what I mean is, please be more inward-centered, yeah? Try not to dissipate your energy, your blessing, by leaking it out through your thinking, you know, into the mind channel or through the mouth channel, okay? When you're thinking about somebody else, you're leaking it into the mind. And the mind is not on the spiritual level. You understand? The mind is only maximum, is second level. Huh? And then you leak into there. That means your, some of your blessings go down there. And you lost it. Okay? Hmm. Uh, whenever you think of someone, of course, you share the karma of that person, at least for that moment. Hmm? Even if you sit next to somebody on the bus or train, you do share. So if you don't want, you repeat five names all the time. You repeat the holy names and protect yourself, okay? But sometimes we forget, yes. And sometimes that person is inside our heart, like a lover or something. Then you finished. <laughs> you can't shake it off. Okay, man. Cook, you want to cry some more or are we done? <laughs> You guys are so cute. Lovely, lovely. Vážení diváci, ceníme si vaší společnosti při dnešní epizodě s názvem Mír a lásky plné potraviny, čtvrtá část ze šesti, v pořadu mezi mistriní a žáky. Prosím, zůstaňte naladěni na Supreme Master Television ke sledování dalších pozitivních pořadů. Následovat bude čtení z tajných textů univerzálního Bílého bratrstva Světlo 
Čteno odaným Teodorem Nikolovem, druhá část ze dvou, pořadu slova moudrosti. Nech tě váš život naplněn bezpodmínečnou láskou a vlídností. For more details, please visit suprememastertv.com for slash bmd.